Hi, and welcome. Do you use a red light for your bearded dragon? Most people use a red light at night for their bearded dragons. I have been told that it is safe because dragons cannot see red. This is actually false. Bearded dragons have been proven to be able to see red, or at, what, at least what we see as red. Reptile vision is quite fascinating, and it is important to take into account that many reptiles actually see UV waves, and actually can see it very well, like other birds and fish do. Most reptiles have four cone receptors in their eyes, opposed to us only having three. This means they can see red and blue way more efficiently than we can, and will appear a lot brighter than them than it is to us. Many pet store owners still misinform their customers and tell them that red lights are safe because bearded dragons cannot see them, and then proceed to talk you into buying some so they can make more money. It was believed that a long time ago, reptiles cannot see red, which now we know now they indeed can, and companies mass-produced colored lights such as reds, greens, blues, and purples and were thought to be ideal for nighttime use. We know now, thanks to many years of research, that reptiles can see the UV spectrum, which enhances their ability to see colors. The only light you should be using is white light bulbs along with a UVB tube, a proper one. Color lights, even during the day, will rinse out all color from their vision palette, making them unable to distinguish between colors. Try swapping out your regular house light bulbs with blue or red light bulbs and look around your room. Can you still tell what colors things are supposed to be? It's the same for them. They cannot distinguish between colors. And for bearded dragons, it's especially important because they usually use color to distinguish between food and objects. Bearded dragons are diurnal, meaning they're awake in the day and sleep at night, just like us. How do we sleep? In the dark, of course, unless you have a nightlight. Bearded dragons in the wild sleep in pitch darkness or in the moonlight, which usually gives off white light, not red, not blue. However, most dragons will try to burrow and sleep in pitch darkness because... That way, they are safe from predators and also can sleep without being disturbed. Using a red light definitely will disturb your dragon at night. And as we learned, they have four cone receptors, so they indeed can see red. Disturbing sleep can cause illness and affect their mental state. Imagine being woken up multiple times each night from a bright light. How annoying would that be? Lack of sleep can also make you sick and will reduce the time your body gets to fix itself. I'm sure you wouldn't enjoy sleeping with all the lights in your room on, would you? Sure, you can fall asleep, but I can't guarantee it will be as comfortable as sleeping in the darkness. If you're using a red light for heat, which you probably are, it is most likely unnecessary. Unless the temperature in your tank drops under 15 Celsius or 60 Fahrenheit, you may choose to use a ceramic heat emitter, which is the same as a heat bulb, but it does not give give off any light and will not disturb your dragon. Also, do not use heat mats for bearded dragons, as they can burn their stomachs. They do not require belly heat at all, and can't really feel it, which may result in burns. Same thing goes for heat rocks, but those things are a lot more dangerous and unstable compared to heat mats. I hope you enjoy the video, and hopefully you learned something new today. As per usual, I have links in the description for you to view if you're interested and have any questions. Also, if you do have any more questions, feel free to leave it in the comment section below and I will gladly answer them. I hope you all have a good day.